context out here in the crowd. I present to you the man that taught Chris Solar a lesson, ladies and gentlemen, the notorious Victorious. this much. He is athletic as we just saw by that cartwheel spin out. Subtly working that arm, just beating him down, wearing it down. Nice reversal by the redneck. And he falls over. Oh, and the redneck misses the counter. And oh! Incredible running boot. I mean, that was an incredible shot. We heard that from over here. Vic standing him up while handsome Johnny Crook shouts out orders. Irish women to the turnbuckle. Trying to go for the hip toss and goes right into the kick to the head. Just, he might have a concussion by the end of this night if he, he just keeps made. making shots like that. Now, reversing the arm drag. Another reversal. Another reversal. And pulls it along the screen. He is outside the ring. Incredible display by these two gentlemen. Well, one of them's a gentleman, Redneck is. The other one, not so much. There are no timeouts in pro wrestling. He should. He's going crazy. Seriously, someone get Johnny Crook off the apron. It's with despicable moves like this. This is why I cannot tolerate the great shoulder and a dirty shot. A, just a dirty move by Victorious. Now, the heat on Victorious is thick. These fans do not like him. Many people don't like him. I'm pretty sure no one likes Victorious. Hey, I'm not a fan, I must say. Too dirty for me. Come on, guys. Oh, just that incredible lariat through the ropes. I mean, like I said, I will give Victorious credit where credit is due. The man is a phenomenal athlete. I thought he was a little girl who was a great gymnast. Yes, I am willing to bet money he was too. Oh. Or, well, she was. Going for the cover. The dirty cover with the choke. Choking him out. See, he always plays dirty. I mean, Vic, Vic should clean up his act and maybe get rid of handsome Johnny Crook and then the fans will respect him. And Johnny Crook is back up on that ring apron. Someone needs to get him out of here. They should make him leave, ban him from the building. Irish whip into that spinning elbow. And 
and the redneck looks hurt right now. Look at all that water. Let's your energy on this redneck. And Johnny, what? He's always bossing them around. Can someone please rip his larynx out? Just and take that speaker from him. Oh, no. Oh, no. That may have been heard all through. Did you hear how that echoed throughout this arena? And the well has already showed another hard knife edge to This is crazy. I mean, that, that is still echoing around the arena. Reversal into the turnbuckle. And Vic scouted it way too well. Oh. I, that was that was really, I will give credit where credit is due. That was an incredible move. I mean, that drop kick after leaping. Red the Red Nick stands him back up. Looks like he's going for a scoop slam. Right down to the mat. Now Vic is going to the mile high club. He's getting up there on that top rope for something big. And something moved out the way. And wait a minute. The psycho superstar is here. We have entered the psycho realm. And Redneck is now distracted. Redneck needs to focus on what's going on in the ring and what's going no, what's going on outside the ring. Vic is back up to his feet, and now he's just scouting. He is waiting for his opportunity just to dismantle the Redneck. The referee with oh and a super kick, the Vic kick. One, two, three. This is just awful. He just got beat in the match and now he's getting beat down after the fact. Oh, and disgusting. Blowing a snot rocket onto somebody. That is just, like the psycho superstar. That is Bush League. Very Bush League. MWF would like to say, we do not condone the actions of the psycho superstar and what he just did. He's a padded cell. He should be fined. He should be locked up. He should be put somewhere in a mental hospital in a psychiatric ward somewhere. And no one's cheering on the psycho. No one.